Do you like horses? Have you always dreamed of going to an aesthetic summer camp where you can meet new friends, hang out around the campfire, and bond over your love of horses? Well then come on down to Yorvik Riding Camp just outside Moreland Stables. Spend the summer caring for and riding horses. Maybe even fulfill your destiny in an extraplanetary fight between all that's good and a mysterious dark force named Garnock. You might even want to stay longer than the summer. And you can! For more details, sign up at StarStable.com. The Yorvik Tourism Committee is not responsible for physical or emotional trauma related to the fight between good and evil. And they don't even know the half of it. Yorvik is a beautiful place, full of horses and people who care about them. But there's also people who don't. Greedy corporations trying to claim land for themselves, trying to strip nature of its resources without a care of the people and animals who call this place home. Oh, and the extraplanetary fight against good and evil? That's true, too. Sure, Yorvik riding camp was a lot of fun, but it was only just the start of my adventure here on Yorvik. A bunch of us actually stayed after the summer to help the people of Yorvik, for things as small as making deliveries, setting up new races, to bigger things like preparing bridges and mediating decade-long family feud. We're called the Soul Riders, we're a sisterhood of sorts. We are the frontline fighters defending Yorvik against Garnok and his Dark Riders. But we could always use more help. Are you with us? Sign up and play for free with the link in the description. So, theatrics aside, let's talk about what you can expect when you play Star Stable Online. For starters, and full disclosure, my name is Ursus Zvenge, I post Star Stable videos every Wednesday update. In game, you can find me as Arya Mistwood or Shiloh Stormfire, and Star Stable is without a doubt my favorite game. Even if I wasn't recording YouTube videos, I would be playing this game all the time. And I have been. I played this game long before I actually started recording videos for YouTube on Star Stable. I'm just so genuinely passionate about this game, and I want to share it with everybody. So, let's talk about what you can expect when you sign up for Star Stable Online. First things first, Star Stable Online is what's called an MMO, or a Massive Multiplayer Online Game. It means that it is a multiplayer game that you can play with other people or by yourself and go on your own adventure completing quests for other NPCs or non-player characters. Star Stable Online is all about caring for and sharing your love of horses. It takes place on an island called Yorvik, whose culture heavily revolves around everyone's love of horses. It's said that on Yorvik, there's no bond stronger than a rider and their horse, and that pretty much fuels the entire theme of the game. This horse I'm on right here is named Jellybean. She is absolutely one of my favorites. She's a Halfinger, which is my favorite breed of horse. And I truly would not have known that if I didn't play Star Stable. Before I played Star Stable, I really didn't know all that much about horses. And I can say in three years of playing this game, I have learned a lot and I'm always wanting to learn more. It has truly fueled my passion for horses, and I love it. When you sign up for Star Stable, you can play for free up to level five and do all the quests that get you to that level. And when you play for free, you have access to a few different areas. You have full reign of Jorvik Riding Camp, Moreland, and I believe Fort Pinta. That also includes three championships, Moreland, Fort Pinta, and the Pony Championship. You also have access to all of the daily quests and races that happen in those areas as well. Daily quests are different than the normal quests. The normal quests will get you experience and continue progressing the story as long as it goes. And daily quests are things like stable chores and fetch quests that you can repeat daily. Those story quests are what's going to end at level 5. But if you decide that you want to keep going with the story, you can sign up to be what's called a Star Rider. Star Rider is a paid subscription, either paid monthly or in a one-time fee, and that's what's called Lifetime. Personally, I went straight to Lifetime because I kind of fell in love with the story, as weird and silly as it is, and I just wanted it to keep going, and honestly, I have not regretted it since. I've actually done that on two accounts, but we're not going to talk about that. So, let's say you become a Star Rider. What then? You'll suddenly get access to the rest of the quest line all over the world. You'll still have to unlock it though according to the story, but you'll still be able to travel almost anywhere immediately. And the world of Jorvik is fairly wide. I mean, from this one point, I can see Dundal over in the corner. You have Firgrove beyond those trees. There's also the dense forest in the back, which is Veildale. Up in the mountains, you have Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur. Just past this hill here and the silo and the castle is Silverglade. And way past the castle, you have Golden Hills Valley and Cape West Fishing Village. You have the Forgotten Fields. And even furthermore this way, you have New Hillcrest and Old Hillcrest. Jarlaheim, the rest of Epona and Southhoof, 
and hundreds of races and quests that you can complete and redo daily. And that's just the content that the game provides you. There is a big community of Star Stable role players who do different things. There's also riding clubs that you can join for a sense of community and competitive spirit. And there are riding clubs for everything. Me and my friend Apple founded the Dragon Dragonflies, which is really just our friend group. But it's still fun to hop online together, competing in races and running around as a group. There are clubs for dressage and trail rides and different riding disciplines. Between the roleplay opportunities, the communities you can form, and the open world of it all, Star Stable really is the game that you make it to be. Whether you just want a free starter account or you want to sign up to be a full-fledged Star Rider, you can use the link in the description below to sign up for a free account. And because I am a Star Stable affiliate, using my link does also help me as well. And if you do happen to make your way over to Yorvik and see me running around, go ahead and throw me a friend request. I would love to be friends. So if you're ready to hop in the saddle, press the link in the description and I'll see you on Yorvik. Bye!